Today I'm at Moak Hill Elementary School and we're doing an after school STEM activity getting kids interested in and excited about science, technology, engineering and math. Today what the kids are doing is they're building a small electric motor to learn more about electromagnetism and about how and why things happen in the world around us. Common Core is giving us the opportunity to allow our kids to think more critically and not be afraid of taking chances and as teachers we can take chances with our students. A fishbowl activity is something that we do throughout the school year. It is a great activity for the kids to be able to interact with each other and of course the big C's of Common Core, it incorporates creativity, you've got collaboration, you've got communication, you've got critical thinking skills that are done in a low stress environment. It's a high engagement activity. You've got speaking and listening. The students getting to talk about this and discuss it and go back and forth with data and evidence and they address things like ethos and logos and pathos um, in their conversations. It really helps build up the um, Common Core activities and the Common Core caliber. Throughout the year we have been studying preparing for the AP exam which is studying a lot of facts, a lot of figures, a lot of people, a lot of events. So this lesson, the All-American Buffet, is each student was to prepare a dish represented of an ethnic group that have added to the fabric of this nation. And in it they have learned, they have synthesized, and they have developed a presentation making it all personal and all physical to the learning that they have achieved through the last 10 months. In my class, what we're doing with Common Core in my marine biology program is uh, creating robes. They do everything from soldering to wiring to fabrication, construction, uh, buoyance control, everything that they could possibly experience if they were in the field um, as an engineer so that students engage and they take control of their learning. Um, it's messy and it's loud and teachers are often uncomfortable with this because their classrooms don't look like what tradition has told us classrooms should look like. Students in rows and students listening and paying attention. It's not balanced, right? We need to balance this. Sort of this. Okay. I teach science, technology, engineering, and math. And STEM is all about Common Core. It's about integrating academic knowledge with real world skills to make something meaningful for our students so that when they get out of school, they have the capability of working immediately in a useful job. Most jobs are not done in isolation, they're done in a team. And these kids need to learn the skills to have to work with, with peers that they agree with, that they don't agree with. Um, they, they learn collaboration skills and they learn how to um, interact and hopefully that will help them when they get out into the world. I'm able to teach less. I'm able to participate more with my students. There's less grading, there are less behavior problems, and these are all perks for us as teachers.